This episode of Soldier Knows Best is brought to you by Netflix. Hey, what's up, guys? Soldier Knows Best here, here with the unboxing of one of the most popular Kickstarter projects of all time. This is the Ouya Gaming Console. So, this is basically like an open source um, gaming system that's based off of Android. It's going to be featuring games from any developers and also major developers as well. So, a lot of people have a lot of interest in this $99 console. So, here's going to be my unboxing of it. So, check it out. All right, so I have the box for the Ouya right here. It's a pretty simple and plain black box. Let me go ahead and get my unboxing knife and cut this tape. And so this has been a, a very anticipated launch of the Kickstarter. It's probably one of the most popular Kickstarter uh, launches out there. All right, so we got the lid off of the Ouya. We see, thank you for believing, no problem. I like believing in new projects like this. All right, so now we have the Uwa console itself and the controller. So we're gonna take a look at the controller first. Let me set that to the side and I'll get all this tape off of here. And the last piece of plastic here. All right, so I got all that stuff off of here. All right, just for my first time holding it here, I will say it's a pretty lightweight controller. It's a very nice, comfortable grip on there. Uh, it's not the most expensive feeling controller out there compared to the 360 or the PS3, uh, but it is nice overall. We have the D-pad right here. Uh, we have the uh, buttons here, O-U-Y-A, the name of the console. Uh, looks like we have a power button that maybe used as a menu button. I'm not really sure yet. Then we have dual analog controls as well. So it's more, more similar to the controller on the Xbox 360 out of anything. Um, one thing you notice, you have, uh, looks like, I don't know what these, they are calling these triggers or shoulder buttons, but you have four basically shoulder buttons. And it looks like these will be acting as triggers because on the back you don't have any triggers at all. So it does feel a little weird in the beginning, but I think it will be just fine when you're playing games. All right, so let me bring the box back over here and we can go ahead and get to the start of the show. This is the UWA console right here. It's pretty small, but before I actually do that, let me go ahead and uh, see what we have underneath here. It looks like we have two AA batteries to put into the controller, and also we have an HDMI cable, uh, which uh, people have been saying is pretty small for an HDMI cable, but at least they throw it in there. Uh, most companies don't include that, uh, but you can kind of see the length of it. It's not that big, so you may have to use another one. Uh, but then also we just have the uh, wall adapter here to charge it up, or actually not to charge it up, but to plug it in and give it power. Uh, then we have the instruction manual, and then we go ahead and get this stuff out the way and get to the console. And here is the console, and let me go ahead and get all this plastic off of here just like I did for the controller. And I think this is the last piece of protective layer there. All right, here is the UWA console. You can see, I mean, it fits in the palm of my hand, basically. It's a very small console, so it's gonna be pretty portable. I mean, if you wanna take this thing um, on the road with you or wherever you go to your friend's house or if you're traveling, uh, this thing is not gonna take up that, that much room at all. And as we take a look at the back, we do have a few ports. We have an ethernet port and also a micro USB port. We have one single USB 2.0 port and a HDMI port that's gonna be used for 1080p gaming. And at the top, you will find the power button, and then that's about it. That's all the buttons and ports um, here on the Ouya. And so it's a very small, capable machine of you know decent graphics that could be bringing you next generation graphics as you can tell by the size of the thing but um, it's gonna be very useful for for, for gamers and developers um, independent developers and major developers to get on board to start developing for this uh, gaming console we're gonna see how this thing turns out so anyway this is my unboxing of the Ouya all right, so that's been my unboxing of the Ouya. Please leave your comment down below and also stay tuned for my review, which I'll be posting very shortly. But before I do end this video, it's going to take one let's look at our sponsor. And today's sponsor is Netflix. Now, if you don't know, Netflix is the place to go for streaming movies and TV shows, no matter where you are, to your cell phone, to your TV, uh, to your Xbox, your PlayStation, your Nintendo Wii, almost every device right now has a compatible Netflix application where you can watch this content on the go. So they have thousands of titles to choose from, so you'll never be bored. If you want to get a free trial membership right now, you can go to netflix.com forward slash soldier. Again, that's netflix.com forward slash soldier to get your free trial membership. All right, so that about wraps this video. All the links to my social networks are down below my Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And thanks for watching this video, guys, and I will catch you later. Peace.